Welcome to Collections in Assembly. I'm going to show you how to create, pin, and share collections. I have a collection for all of my important flows for easy access. I can add or remove flows from this collection at any time. You can add any important items to your collections and access them via your navigation on the left if the collection is pinned. To add a link, go to the collection you want to add it to, click the three dotted menu, and click Add a Link. You can also add important files you use in your day-to-day -day work if you have uploaded them in assembly or connected your assembly to one of our file storage apps. Simply go to your files tab, search for the file name, click the three dotted menu for that file, and add it to the collection that you'd like. To create a new collection, click create a collection. Give your collection a name, a description about what your collection does or what it contains, and then select whether you'd like to pin this collection to your navigation for easy access. You can add anything in assembly to any collection. Simply search for what you'd like to add, click the three dotted menu, and choose a collection to add it to. Your collections are always visible to you, but you can also share important collections of information with other people in your company, provided you have the permissions. To select who you'd like to share the collection with, you can select department, work or home location, job title or manager status. To share it with a department, click the department rule and select which department or departments you want to share with. You can preview everybody that you're sharing with by clicking the preview list. You can also add people as collaborators. Collaborators can edit and modify the collection at any time, just like the owner. They can also share it with other people in the assembly. Click done to save your collection. Once you've shared, this collection will appear for everybody with whom you've shared it with, and it will appear in their assembly automatically.